And what we do is we meet once a month, the special ed team with the regular ed teachers who share students that are showing a bigger gap between their reading scores than their um, peers. And what we do when we meet is talk about a targeted skill in the area of reading um, as a way that we can close the reading gap. And then with that targeted skill, how we're gonna go about um, teaching it, presenting the lesson to them, and having a common language. Before we enacted um, the collaboration plan, we would just you know, quickly meet in the morning here and there and not have the time to meet and look at the data and what the students need. With the planning time, the collaborative planning time, we can actually sit down, look at our data, what the students are doing, and work on those targeted lessons and come up with collaborative words that you know all of us are using to help that stud the students learn. We really um, are working on using common language so that not only are we focusing on the same goals and objectives um, when we work with our students, but we're using the same language so it can kind of be seamless and consistent so that the um, students really know um, what our focus is and the learning objective. So what are the areas that you guys are going to focus on for the vocabulary terms? I'm thinking if we do clusters, because last year in third grade they just combined it all and said clusters, so it's easier for him to remember that that means two or three letters that go together. One of the targeted skills we were working on was um, the WH zone, and we called it a blend and the student was struggling with it and we couldn't get it. We changed it to cluster. We worked um, as a group and used cluster to see if it would help him remember the WH sound. And it's been more successful using cluster as our um, word instead of blend. We take star data. We do a lot of formalized data, screenings. Um, the district in Green Bay, um, we have a lot of expectations for assessments. And we do have the data to support that our students are making progress.